My name is Andreas Googland and I'm going to take you through the game. Uh, we have seen the first rock delivered by Panthera playing with the red rocks. Okay, playing for Panthera, Fanny Sjöberg lead and uh, Elin Lövstrand second, Jenny Volin third and Isabella Vrano skip. Uh, playing for Seco Granit, we have Sara Larsson at lead, Johanna Höglund second, Emily Byman skip and playing third rocks and Sara Pengel fourth and vice skip. I talk with the team before the game and uh, this is the opening uh, Panthera we're looking for. Yep. A defensive first end and uh, later on in the second or third end starting to play a more offensive kind of game. We have um, three other games on sheet four, five, and six, uh, where we can see this two two men's team and uh, one other women's team. We have on uh, sheet four Sweden Nitro playing Poland Jano Jarov, and on sheet five Norway taking on Sweden Ek. Sub, and finally on sheet six, Aus Austria taking on Swedish Castrix. We are going to look through what happens on the other sheets in the beginning of each end and uh, then focus on this featured game here on sheet 3. And uh, we are looking at the game in uh, group D. And the second and the third places are going to be decided in this game. Uh, we also have uh, the Norwegian Stabæk playing versus Sweden uh, Eksab from Malung and uh, that's probably going to end with a Norwegian victory and therefore be um, a t <laughs> sorry a group victory for the Norwegian team the Norwegian girls ha has played a solid game through th throughout the torment tournament so there's going to be a lot of hard work for the Swedish Malung team on sheet 5 to beat them. You are more than welcome to make comments on our fa Facebook page, Live Channel Cup. You can search for that, that if you haven't already liked it. Make comments and ask questions and we'll be happy to answer them.
Schappa när. Normal. Ja. And we have um, five more rocks to play in this first end. And uh, Granit Buman with yellow rocks has the advantage of uh, last rock in this first end. Which probably is going to be a blank end. And uh, probably too we are going to see more offensive kind of game in the second end. Emily Buman, third and skip for Granit. Plays a guard. I don't know if that was supposed to be, but it makes this first end a little bit more interesting anyway. And we'll now see him fourth and skip in the uh, team, Pan team Panthera. Isabella Vrano playing her first rock for for the game. Whoa. Whoa. Let me up. Yep. This team, Whoa. Team Panthera, has five years left as um, junior players. And the goal for the season is to win the juniors masters in Sweden and there after that go on and play the worlds for juniors. A bit heavy but a good line behind the guard and uh, we can now see Sara Pengel playing fourth for um, Seco Granit Jävlen. Wow. Looking heavy. No line, getting better. Got line. Mm, makes the job. Isabella Verano just want to remove the yellow stone in the house. Two more rocks to play in the first end. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Nah, bara ta bort den nu första. Sen Ja. Last rock, first end. We have Sara Pengel 
who just wants to clean the house and keep the last rock advantage for the second end. No, it's a one-pointer in the first end, and uh, Tim Panthera got the end where they wanted it. And there are still rocks to be played in the first end on all other sh sheets, so we can't say anything about the other games yet. But we can say that uh, on sheet six we have... Um, game in the boys A group where um, uh, Austria's team Wanderer meets Sweden team Kath Kastrix and um, they are going to decide just the same as on this sheet 3 who is going to be second and who is going to be third in the group we have on sheet 5 playing in the same group as these Did girls Norway Stobek versus Sweden Malung Ek Eksab, where Norway has won all their games and Malung has lost all the their games. So if Malung will win, then there will be a uh, team measurement between the loser in this game and uh, Malung who will okay, be it. in the third spot and go through to, to the playoffs. There will be no tiebreakers games in this tournament. Mm. Finally playing on sheet 4, Sweden Nitro vers versus Poland. In the boys oh, group B. And um, that's just going to Whoa. decide who Nej, is uh, going to be last and second last in Group B. They have no chance for playoff, these two teams on Sheet 4. A miss and a good chance for um, Isabella Verano to put up for taking two, at least two rocks with her in this end. Sandra Gullbring lead in Team alltså, Pantera. Emot, ah, okay. Played a Nej. little bit heavy. And giving second Elin Lövstrand. I'm oh, sorry. Second Johanna Höglund in uh, granit chance to hit and roll. Johanna Höglund, second in Granit Gävle. Now we have second for Panthera, Elin Lövstrand. Yep. 
the end, whoa. Whoa. Whoa, Hardig, Hardig. Whoa, whoa. Nej. Jo, kör då, jag kör. Kör då. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Jag kör, kör, kör. Eller vad? Elin Lövstrand, second in Team Panthera. Så länge det inte är tjapp så går det nog bra. Johanna Höglund. It's yep. going to play hit and roll. The yep. only thing they are not looking for is a nose hit. Den är liksom hel igenom. Sluta, stopp. Wow! Ja, oh, dra den upp. Japp! Dra den så långt ut du kan, så långt ut du kan. Kör, 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 kör. Ta dig iväg. Så so har played half the second end. And um, we have um, Emily Byman, skip and third player in Granit Jävle, gliding down to the hack to deliver her first stone in the second end. Why skip, Sara Larsson. Ja! Ja! Ja, för tröv! Ja, ni kan släppa den. Ni kan släppa den, tror jag. Miss by Emily Byman gives uh, Pantera a new good chance to pick up a deuce in the second end. Oh, sorry, my mistake there. A good chance for uh, Byman to steal a point is the right call from me. So we have Emily Buman. Just want to put the rock in the rings out top twelve foot. Making it as hard as possible for Panthera to do a double or anything, but this looks a bit heavy. Way too heavy. More 
heck wait uh, than anything else. And a new, new chance for Panthera to put some pressure on Granit. Yeah! 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 Shad! Drop! Nu har du fått den där lilla vicken in igen. Bara försök att putta ut dem. Det är, det är, normalt behöver vi inte vara så här hårda, men det är bra. Bra att du insisterar. And we are down to the four last stones of the second end. We have the Sara Pengel. Fourth player in um, Bymans team from Granit Gävle. Wow, 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 wow. Vi kan dra emot dem. Ja, men vi lägger den här. Okej, vi lägger den här, för då måste de antingen vika ut, de kommer ju aldrig våga gå på typ chatten. För då... För grejen finns, om de kör inifrån, så kommer den gå åt så, då kan de vika tillbaka in. Vad tror ni för fack? Okej. Okay. We hear the girls talking what weight they should play, and uh, I talk with... Um, Matthias Marbers, general of this tournament, whoa, said whoa, that the split yeah, times up, are between 390 and 395. And um, 4.5 feet of curl yeah. all over the ice. Yes! Yes! Whoa, they get it, get it. Two more rocks to play, and uh, yes. Sara Pengel for Granit Gävle plays her last ro rock for the second end. Yes. Yes. Bara bika av mina. Last rock, second end. Isabella Vrano wants Whoa. to blank the end. Hit and roll yes. off. Looking good. No problem. And uh, Panthera playing in the red stones will still have the last rock advantage when we go in for the third end. These games are played in eight ends and then one tiebreaker or extra end if um, if needed. And if the extra end is blanked, then the team with uh, not the last rock advantage will win the game. If we have a look at the other sheets, we can see on sheet six that team Austria versus Sweden Castrix is uh, zero points to Austria and one to Cath Castrix after the first end. We see on sheet five that Norway Stabæk leads with two points versus Swedish Eksab. And uh, no 
numbers yet on the, call. on the board for on sheet four where Swedish Nitro meets Poland Janov Sara Larsson Granit Gävle Fanny ja. Sjöberg. Ja, men ni kan släppa Le den. Den är inte överhåg. Oh. Den är väl inte överhåg, är den? Kör då. Jobba då. Bara över, för vi måste kunna gömma oss bakom den. Men vad fan. Sarvigt av er. Kom igen nu. Isabella Vrana. Fanny, nu. Kom igen. Isn't happy with the... the Broomers. They could have worked a bit harder on that and uh, gotten it over the hog line. Instead, Sara Larsson can uh, play Yeren under stone into the house. Det är okej, bara ta den och lägga sig där. Spela lite plus. Pantera looking for the double. Wow. Ja! Ja! Kör! Kör, kör, kör! Väcker efter, väcker efter, väcker! Låt mig spel. Pretty good uh, outcome there anyway. Keeping the rocks close together. We had uh, Johanna Höglund second in uh, Granit Gävle. Elin Lövstrand ja! Ja! wants to do a double takeout. Ja! Det är jätteviktigt att du, du skulle träffa på den sidan, för den här fanns inte lika bra. Ah, ja, så, så in. Kom igen nu tjejer! All these girls are or have been students of the Swedish Curling Academy here in Härnösand. So this is more or less their home eyes. Spel här och vicka in. Normal. Wow. 
Helen Lövstrand, second, playing her last rock for the third end, which yep. means we have come yep. halfway in sh 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 in the third end. Whoa. Sorry. Ska jag soppa den innan för mitt fel? Emily Buman, third and skip. Is sliding down to the other side of the ice to make a hit and stay. Just want to roll half a feet or something. Jenny Volin oh. playing third for Panthera. Aldri. Kala. Kala. Kolla upp. Den är här. Yes. Lugnt, lugnt, rent, rent, rent. Rent. Det är helt okej okay om den är över tid. Helt okej okay om den är över tid. Det är ingen fara. Bra. Wow, den är sen. Emily Buman looking for a hit and stay and uh, we're probably going to see a blank end in this, this third end as well. It's sufficient to get the redstone out of the house and let's see, yeah, it hangs in there. Pretty good result for Granit playing with the yellow rocks. Five more rocks to play, this one included. And it's time for Isabella Vrano 
Laying her first rock for the third end. Three more rocks to play. And um, we're probably, probably going to see a blanket. Hangs in there and does the job. And uh, we have um, Sara Pengel who needs to deliver, playing her last rock for the third end. Hit and stay is yeah. the call. Does the job, rolls off, Kolla. and uh, we're just going to see how Isabella Brano runs the stone through the house for yet another blank end. And um, we, viewers and commentators and producers, can just hope for oh, a bit in. more offensive play in the fourth end. We want to see some action. And uh, if you are bored and just trying to figure, figure out what you're going to do, you can always write on our Facebook page. Search for Live Channel Cup and uh, like us and write some something on our timeline. Okay, we could hear that Isabella Vrano wants some more action in the in the game. She wants a few corners and uh, hope for some misses from uh, Granits when they are going to play in the four fourth end. And we have the Sara Larsson. Nice skip and lead in Sweden Seco Granit Jävlen. Playing with the yellow rocks. The score is 1 to Sweden Granit and 0 for Sweden Panthera. If we look on the other sheets, we can see that Norway Stabæk, in the same group as these girls, leads seven to nothing versus Sweden Malung is Exab, and Norway will be the number one in the group, heading straight to semifinals, while uh, these two girl uh, teams will. Um, go for the quarterfinals tonight. The second in this group, Group D, Jana will Kana. meet the third Jana team whoa, in whoa, whoa. Group Nei. C. Oh, and that will be Sweden and Westman from Jusholm. Second team in uh, Group C is Team Rilea. And uh, group winner in Group C is uh, the Swiss team Langenthal. So it looks like Switzerland and Norway are going to play the semi-finals tomorrow with um, the winners, the 
quarterfinal games tonight at 8 o'clock. Spel den! Spel sig! Ja! Ja! Fötterät! Jobba fötterät! Förkör! Okej. Okay. Helt okej okay, det där. Kör köppen. Well, it wasn't the call, but um, still a pretty good result for Panthera. And um, Emily Byman is looking for a no sit. Yep. Yep. Kör. Rotte, kör. Kör. Kör samma sådär då. Vilket håll vill du spela? Du kan spela här om du vill. Spela normalt. New chance for Ellen Lövstrand to hit and roll behind the corner guard. som gör det, det är bara halvmissar. Om vi bara sätter dem helt så är det lugnt. Det går bra. Isabella Vrana trying to pep talk. Her team members. To just play a little bit better. Johanna Höglund looks a bit heavy again. And this is going to run through the house and a good chance now for Panthera to come down and um, hide behind the corner guard. Känns i ett och håll. Aldrig! Har snart rygg. Ja, kör då. Ja. Ta den bakom. Fan, ni är totalt sanna. Ah, ja. Den ligger typ halvjämn så. Alltså typ bak, alltså bara dragning. Bra Elin. Den frisa men lite hårdare kanske. Just want to get down and freeze on the red one. Emily Byman, a bit insecure how much ice she sh should take. And uh, let's see now. 
if she can find the way to make a perfect freeze. Time for Jenny Volin and Team Panthera to put some pressure on Granit Jävle playing the Yellow Rocks. Want to be two counter zones in the house. Just in the house, and uh, I wonder which rock is the second rock now. The yellow one in the back of the house, or the red rock in front of the house. Det är ingen katastrof den. Men jag vill inte komma åt den så den puttar in. Men jag vet inte, även om vi drar hit så har de ändå knacken ner. Vad ska de annars göra? Jag är ganska säker på vår anläggning. Det känns som att man... Alltså jag är inte helt säker. Well, I can't bite a better. Yeah, we drop it. Tommy, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. Yeah. 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 In Jävle Granit. She doesn't want to risk to go in the, the red stone in the, in the top of the house. And Emily is quite convinced that uh, the yellow stone in the back of the house is better than the red one in front of the house. In top of on the top of the house. Atta deras gård. Bara fart. Pretty good results. Forcing uh, Panthera to play a promotion Whoa. takeout. And 
We are down to the four last stones of the fourth end. Sara Pengel for Jävle Granit. Playing yellow stones. We go first. And Emily Byman wants to play. A defensive kind of game. Removing the red rock in the back. But I think that's a wise, wise decision. Sara Pengel hit yep. and stay. Yep. It's the best yep. scenario. Well, and well, uh, well. second best that's is that's just to remove the red rock. Nice play by Sara Pengel. And Isabella Rano will play the hit and roll. Hit and roll behind um, those two corner guards. Played and it's shot rock. Great play by Isabel Velavrano. And a tough decision yeah. now for Emily Buman. Doesn't have mu much options. Wants to hide behind the corner guard. At least half the stone needs to be hide, hidden behind the, the corner guard. This has no line so far. Pretty good play by Sara Pengel. Yeah. 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 Playing with the weight back of the house to the back of the house and uh, just push the yellow shot rock out on the red. Isabella. Skip for Team Panthera. Changes their goal for this rock. Just want to play a draw. And if it's a bit heavy, then they can do something more with it. Whoa. Heavy and no line so far. Oh. Here comes the curl. Is it enough? No. And we will have a steal of one Sorry in the fourth end. Granit Jävle Byman will take a two to nothing lead after four ends and half the game. And we will now go to a short rest and be right back with the fifth end in a few minutes. <laughs> 
Il y a ce qu'il y a pour le casque. Je ne sais pas. Vilka killar. Ja, det där var ju... Man har... Jag tror att han var på väg in här. Ja, men jag tänkte att jag, tror att jag liksom beslutade mig fel. Antingen behövde jag dra eller så behövde jag göra den där. Och då blev det någonstans mitt mellan och så bara... Men ni ville trycka ner den? Ja. Ja, jag tycker det är rätt. Du får tanka lite i bra lägen. Ja. Så det är fint. Men det är bra eller inte bra faktiskt. Men... Men det är, de har inte de inte olika sätt allihopa. Så har du honom så här, hon är tika, jag ska ta äh, pengar. Mm. Då gör man så här liksom. Den ska vara mycket, mycket mindre än de andra. Alltså det är verkligen... Nej, men, nej, men jag trodde den var lite hårdare än vad det var. Och jag ville verkligen inte att det skulle dras ner längre ner, för då hade det liksom bjudit in dem till en. Men det är ändå när du börjar, hur du kan börja dra, så då stannar du upp i den tiden. Nej,
Whoa. Yep. Whoa. Schnicked. Löten. Bara fas. Måste köra. No line on this one. And a pretty heavy as well, so it will go straight through the house. Knacka, eller ska vi bara dra runt? Dra bara runt den! Topp fyra blir bra! And while we yeah. we are watching um, Elin Lövstrand Whoa. playing second in Panthera, I can inform you Whoa. that at 8 o'clock tonight we will show Whoa. you the game between Whoa. Team Right Eyes and the winner yeah. on sheet yeah, 6, i.e. Austria or right. Sweden right Castrix. That's the 8 o'clock game, the quarterfinals in Live Channel Cup 2013. And um, the winner in this game will face yeah. Swedish the Swedish yeah. team Jusholm Westman in the quarterfinal at eight o'clock. And the loser will meet the second in the second uh, in the group C team Rilia. Sorry. I asked coach Jerry Volin before the game, if this game is yeah. important. Whoa. And his uh, straight I'm answer in. was, well, it's always important to win. Yep. Whoa. Whoa. Are they okay? Great play by Elin Lövstrand. Yeah. Putting Jävle Byman in trouble again. Stays in the house, and that might be important important later on in this end. Normal. The hat okay. Can show a little up, though. We haven't charged him again. We saw that um, Granit Buman just had one sweeper. Sara Dalsson is out of the ice Come for the moment. Yep. Yep! 
Emily Buman just want to the nose hit. They are not aiming for the roll behind the center guard. Hit and stay is the call. den kommer typ så här bakkant. Ska vi ta? Samma som förra gången så. Det är lite mindre. Ja så. Jag är så arg. Det viktigaste är att den går förbi då, men... Spela så arg. Va? Alltså, det är okej okay med att vicka ut. Men jag tycker nästan man kan, om det, det finns en invick på den. Så om den kommer så, så är det så arg. And we are playing the skip stones now. Four stones more to play in this sixth end, where oh. Team Pantera playing the Red Rocks. Rocks are in the lead oh. with three points okay. to two. Versus Granit Buman. Yeah, sure. And a new good chance for um, Sara Pengil, fourth, fourth player in Buman's team, to hit and roll behind the center guard. And a new chance for Pantera to force Sara Pengel for a four foot draw for the point in the sixth end. Two more rocks to play. Sixth end. We spela så här så vi kan in på den. Typ om vi vickar halvt in så är det också helt okej. Bara vi får någon slags vick. Har vi lite mindre isen för det också. Yeah, yeah, yeah! 
Great played by Isabella Vrano. And Sara Pengel and uh, Emily Byman looking for the back of the 12th foot wait to push the red shot rock. No line, no line at all, and we are going to have a steal of how many points? One, two points, and a five to two lead of the six ends for Sundbyberg Panthera versus Granit Jävle Byman. And we can hear the small talk between the end between Isabella Vrano and her teammates and also a bit from uh, Emily Bumand and so far Isabella Vrano has uh, won the mental game versus uh, Emily Buman showing much more self-confidence and security when calling the shots. Fanny Sjöberg lead playing the first rock of the seventh end. Now Emily Beeman has to go all in. And uh, we see that Sara Larsson has left the game. Yep. So second Johanna Höglund will play the f first three rocks for yep. Granit Gävle. Emily Beeman will play the next three rocks for Granit. And finally we will have Sara Pengel playing skip rocks or fourth rocks as usual. They did not get the corner they want or wanted. It's more like a center guard. Good chance for Panthera to close the game. And if we look at the other sheets, we see that uh, Sweden Castrix leads versus uh, Austria team Wanderer with uh, 6 to 1 after 5 ends, taking a 3 pointer in the 5th end which means that we probably probably are going to see Castrix versus Swedish team Right Ice here at live channel at um, 8 o'clock tonight in the quarterfinal game. Yep. We yep. see on sheet 5 that uh, Norway team Stabek leads yep. with uh, 11 to 1 versus Swedish team Malung Eksub. Make them, making them a clear group winner here in group D. And uh, already clear for semi finals tomorrow at 8 o'clock. Rent! Rent! Whoa! 
Mia, yup. Whoa. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Show your bio bio no nero. Here I can hear I can hear I can hear I can show show show. Are you up? Alltså vi måste nästan försöka trycka bort den där. Alltså och kör typ. Kör sarg. Isabella Vrano calls for yet another top of the eight foot stone delivered by Elin Lövstrand second in Team Panthera. Ut, ut, ut. Ja! 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 Wow! Wow! Kom igen! Ja! Wow! Ja! Wow! Det räcker, det räcker, det räcker! Det är ner mot ju! Herregud, den är jättehård! Aj! Där måste ni! Ja, det kan man göra. Ni måste! Där får ni bara släppa den. Skit i vad jag säger om linjen. Bara släpp! Jag har ändå slagit sen och de delar dem. Där är så. Det är ett fan is. Alltså. Jag vill inte ha en medal. Ta lite. Alltså, vi drar emot det. Ska lite mindre. Well, not much works now for Granit Jävle, and uh, my guess is that they have already started to think about the quarterfinal game tonight at 8 o'clock instead. This game seems to be over, where we will have uh, Swedish team Pantera from Sundbyberg as winners. This means they will meet, meet another Stockholm team, Jusholm Seko and Westman in the quarterfinal tonight. While um, Granit Jävlebyman will take on team Rilea. 
in the second quarterfinal. Jag tror den ligger ganska bra där faktiskt. Det gör så inte de har ett drag. Annars skulle de kunna ha ett drag och lägga sig där. Alltså vi kan garda, eller ska vi till och med göra så att vi lägger den här. För det här jag ser att de har en enda ingången in. Här tycker jag. Här, här. Där är det svårt för dem att göra någonting. Visst, de kan komma och lägga en typ här eller försöka på sig och slå lite, men de kommer, vi kommer alltid ligga skott där. De kommer alltid komma ut liksom. Så jag lägger här. Någonstans. Well, they can't close all the doors for Granit Jävle. And finally, Isabella Vrano has decided to close one way in at least. Ja! Ja! Det går bra! Ja, var med! Ja! Wow, wow, wow! Ja! Wow, räcker, räcker, räcker! 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 Ja, det är bra. It does something. And bra inning. Emily Byman needs to do some magic now to keep this game alive. Alltså om man går väldigt mjukt, typ 10, kan man ju trycka ner en hit i alla fall och då ligger de inte med tre. Då ligger de inte med tre. Och sen kommer jag hitta på någonstans. Sen finns det alltid någon att på. För då kommer den här fint utåt. Då kan man skjuta ner den sen. Ta det. Alltså, åker ner och kollar. Bra tjejer. Okay, they just want to tap back the Yellowstone down to the forefoot and uh, then just find something to shoot at, as um, Emily Buman said. Emily Byman needs to play this perfectly now to keep the end and the game alive. Looks a bit... No, it's not heavy. Just rather a bit short. Guard her off. And Isabella Vrano and teammates can close yet another do door for um, Granit Gävle by putting up a guard. Yeah. Bar over. Yeah. No Come on, she has to it. No, it doesn't re reach the hog line. And um, a new chance for Emily Beeman. Playing her last rock for this seventh end. And then we have four more stones to play after that. Jag har svårt att tro att de kommer ner skottet. Ja, eller jo, kanske det kan man göra. Men, men jag skriver att de ska ta det. Om man gör det, då är det bara att upp det ändå. En åtta till dem är väl helt okej okay att Ja, exakt. Men, ja, 
Ali se hore. Altså, hva med deg? Altså, det rett til. Hva holder deg igjen? Heavier than last time. Looks far much longer. And the only positive thing you can say about that is that they now have four stones in the house. Unfortunately, Team Panthera has three stones that are better than any one of the yellow rocks. And we have four more stones to play before we can sum up the seventh end of this eight end game. Does the job, and uh, there might be a chance for Byman. Det var en där jag såg att de hade, men alltså okej om de kommer ner med en då. Så det är bara, jag tror inte alla kan visa. Isabella Vrano says that she doesn't believe everybody, alltså, every stone can be removed. And I alltså, guess you have to... Svår be able to make really heavy take takeouts if you should have a chance to remo move more than one. Hit it as hard as you can, Sara Pengel, and uh, let's see what happens. Så ta typ normal då. Normal plus. Normal plus. Kanske. Jag tror den där lär sitta. De kan ta ut allt. Sara Pengel playing her first rock. Yep. The seventh end. Yep. You have three more stones to play. Bad outcome, and still three points for oh. Team, Pan Team Panthera. Tough luck, Sara Pengel. Better luck next time. And uh, Isabella Vrano is heading down to the hack to play her last rock of the seventh end. Then Sara Pengel has one more rock to save the end. Uh, 
kan ju komma ganska långt ut för de behöver ju lite... Ja, ja. Wow. Wow, wow. Wow. Wow, aldrig. Aldrig. Nej. Det är den här vi har kvar. And road to the forefoot by Sara Pengel is the only thing left to reduce the house to just lose two. And um, my guess is that um, Granit Javle will give up the game after this end. No, a steal of three, and we have an 8-2 lead and an 8-2 win it is. They shake hands and uh, say better luck next time, and uh, that means all the games in the arena is over. We can see that uh, Sweden Castrix has won the game versus Austria Team Wanderer. Which means that uh, Castrix will take on Swedish team uh, Right Eyes at 8 o'clock here at Live Channel. And we will also see um, Team Panthera take on uh, Swedish team Jusholm Westman at 8 o'clock, but we'll, that will not be webcast. Uh, we will also see a game here in the arena where. Um, Team Rilea will meet the loser in this game, which is uh, Granit Byman. And finally, the last quarterfinal will be played between, let's see, Team Wanderer and, no, sorry, Team, team uh, Norway and Team Wanderer from Austria. And uh, we will be right back with an interview with the skip Isabella Vrano.